back, crazy beautiful Verticonians, Vertico here once again for another episode of Jurassic World, the game. Having already released one tonight, as you may or may not be aware, we've had of the Gorgosaurus tournament. This episode is dedicated to the other event that was released, which is the St. Patrick's Day event, which is the battle for gold, or the battle event required herbivores, pot of gold pack. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Before we go ahead and get ready with our top of the morning to your ladies and great Irish impressions that are probably murdering people inside. We'll go ahead and do our race that we forgot to do in the last episode because I'm a genius. Also, my fans just went down on my like, laptop. I'm hoping it's rendering the video that it should be rendering. Otherwise, that's going to be very interesting for me. Um, pedestal place. Right, okay. So, we've got our two pedestals. If you go, Oh, no. In fact, we've got to do um, the different type. No, no. It's pedestal, isn't it? It's pedestal on this episode. It is pedestal. <laughs> right, okay. So, as you may or may or may not be aware, I have to sell these two pedestals in the time it takes you to enter the full screen. No, wait. Exit full screen, like the video, and enter full screen again. So on the count of three, we'll give that a go. Three, two, one. <laughs> Done! Win, bang, bongo, bing, bang. <laughs> awesome all that. If you beat me, feel free to comment down below and brag that you beat me. And if I beat you, please to say so that I can brag too. It's, it's quite nice to be able to brag every now and then, guys, believe it or not. <laughs> right, let's go ahead and get this event started. So we've got herbivores that we need to fight with first. I don't know if it's all going to be herbivores, so I don't want to risk it and put all my best herbivores in. So we'll stick our, uh, I think, fourth, fifth, and th wait, third, fourth, and fifth um, best herbivores. These should suffice. So level 30, 20, and 30, and they're pretty powerful, to be fair. I mean, in fact, this one's more powerful than Stegoceratops, so I know, I'm, I'm confident. I'm confident. I know for a fact they have boosted the Giganocephalus, so I'm kind of intrigued to see what a level 25 would look like now. Or level 20, it looked like a level 25. Um... We'll go for four more reserves and two blocks this time, and then we'll go for some attacks in the next turn. It's an event battle, not a tournament battle, so they're not going to go for crazy, crazy attacks, so I'm okay with that. Um, I'm going to switch out, though, because I have a feeling I might need the Shinosaurus at some point. We'll go for the Frisinosaurus, just go for five attacks and two reserves. So what sort of damage I'm dealing? Three, that's what, 600 attack, probably, roughly? Yeah, 634, just under halfway. Uh, he's going to have eight. He needs to kill me with three, five. So he's got three blocks, um, which pretty much causes some problems at this point. <laughs> right, I can kill him with two, but then he's going to kill me next turn. So I'm just going to go for four reserves and two blocks. I really shouldn't have actually swapped out, to be fair. Um, but I, I kind of need Shinosaurus, and Thrizinosaurus was really just more of a, well, fodder. <laughs> um, right, that's fine. So he's not gone for anything again. I really need to switch out again to Unisaurus because he's a fair balance between the both. So we'll go for one, two, three, four, and three reserves. Only reason I've gone for that is because two will kill him, which it does. Uh, and the, hopefully, so he's gone for two blocks, uh, two reserves, so that comes up six. Okay, he can kill me in three, maybe? If he can, we'll battle find out. If he can't, we won't do it. He can't, meaning I can now go for, we'll say for five attacks and two reserves. Just because Therizinosaurus is pretty, pretty weak. Okay, doesn't kill him, but we've left him with a pretty big gaping hole in his health. He's got seven. Okay, he can kill me in... Oh, we'll find out. Six, so he's got one block. That's not too bad. I think I can kill him in three attacks. Leaving me with... Oh, God, I don't know how much that leaves me with. <laughs> Regardless, the Therizinosaurus should not be able to kill me. Uh, we'll go for three. And then we'll go for three reserves. I didn't actually check how much coins this is costing me, because the pot of gold pack, the main attraction for it is... Well, the main detraction from it is that you don't get a guaranteed legendary which is a or a super rare it's anything common rare super rare so it's like ah ah it should be interesting however can that kill him yeah that just kills him that's fine um you also get loads of coins apparently so that's the main sort of shining star to it but if you're spending like three million coins to win it and you get like twenty thousand, which i'm assuming is ludia's definition of plenty of coins um and yeah i'm gonna be pretty annoyed oh only 140 dna really Guys, I thought we'd gone past this. Yeah, no, it is a million. No, I uh, see what? I'm glad I didn't expose all my herbivores because apparently I'm dealing with something that seems to be very, very difficult. A level 31 Antarctic Pelter. What the hell? I thought it was going to be a herbivore, carnivore, pterosaur. If it's all herbivores, how the hell am I supposed to win this? I don't think I am. I'm just going to have to buy a pack. We'll try anyway. I'm sure there's no harm in trying. I mean... Surely. <laughs> um, I wonder if it, you can do the same glitch you can do with Dino Preservation, where you can just glitch it and win anyway. Hopefully. Because <laughs> I think at this point I'm pretty much screwed. If I can just use my first two to get rid of their first two, we're all right. If I can't, which I probably can't, we're screwed. <laughs> um, right, I'm actually slightly worried at this point, because if this is level two, 
The hell's the left? Oh my good goody aunt. I think he's got one block then. I'm not quite sure. If he'd gone for reserve, one, two. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's got one block. I'm not going to risk it and go otherwise. Dino Kyrus, you glass cannon. I forgot about you. So he's got one block. I say he's got one block. So that's what? Three should be able to kill him. Yeah, four. Four reserves. He didn't go for any blocks. Probably a bad point to decide otherwise. Um, Dark Spell to level 31. I love Intarcha Portal and it's le max level. Or max evolution. You know what I mean. <laughs> right. We'll go for five and we'll go for three reserves. We kill him. Right, okay. My main concerns are out the window. Giganus Ephraim now is pretty easy to kick the butt off. I don't want to have to spend bucks to win this pack, but I'm going to have to. If it's something like, you know, decent bucks in DNA, I'll be great. But I don't think it is, partially because you can buy it for four pounds. That's a common pack. I really hope I'm not fighting for common pack DNA and bucks. I really hope I'm not. <laughs> right, okay, five kills him. Pretty easy. Right, let's have a look at the final battle and decide whether or not we're going to be able to do it. Because, well, we'll soon find out. <laughs> oh, it's herbivores again. And Oh, look at that. Oh, that's reasonable. Oh, that's easier. Oh, okay. It's going to cost me a small fortune, but we'll do it anyway because I'm going to get more bucks as the Tatroy comes in effect tomorrow, probably. So, actually, no, I won't be able to earn the money. Monday, I'll be able to. Oh, but no Tatroy deal. Next Friday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Um... Speaking of which, next Saturday, I'm at Insomnia. If you're heading to Insomnia 57, I might see you there. If not, then I may see you another time. <laughs> right. I'm just going to go for the reserves, and hopefully he'll go for the seven attacks like he did last time, which would be pretty nice. So he's got three. Four and two. Come on, do it. You coward. So he's got six. Six, he goes for four. He goes for six. Right, okay, he's gone full out. Now I know he's gone full out. Okay. Which means I'm pretty sure I can kill him in three which would be nice because it leaves me with a block which is always nice it's always good to be able to block one two three yep that's cool four reserves one block and as long as he doesn't go for four attacks which he won't we'll be fine and i'll just wipe out antarctic pelter at sacrifice of dinochirus leaving me with an ankylodocus to deal with with my antarctic pelter which i'll be able to quite easily to be quite frank um how much attack accuracy does antarctic pelter have only 120 less this really is not a great last cannon, but it's not too bad. Five attacks. Gods for one. Just like last time, in fact. We'll go for three reserves. Uh, he needs to kill me with two. Meaning he needs to go for a minimum five, which if he was at eight, which he doesn't, he has seven. If he goes for seven, he got, he got two blocks, which against six attacks, which is how much I'll have. Seven attacks. He has five blocks. Five blocks against five. Yeah, no, he's lost. He's lost. I've actually won the pack. Huzzah! <laughs> Oh dear me, I did not have enough confidence there. I'm going to see what they justify to be loads of coins, because I've spent 3 million. Bearing in mind I've spent 3 million, which I should be spending on getting uh, statues to level up, Ludia. I'm now going to judge whether or not this is really a pot of gold, or if it's really a pot of mould. So let's find out. Oh, it's just, it is a nice pack, I must say. I'm, I'm glad they're giving us limited edition packs, though. Really? Are you kidding me, Ludia? I do <laughs> This pack stuffed with dinosaurs rarity and plenty of gold. Plenty of gold. Plenty of gold. <gasps> plenty of gold. I got 72,000 gold. Okay. Let's just put that in perspective. I'm currently indebted to that because of that whole thing by 2.9 million. Yeah. Okay, giving us plenty of gold cards doesn't mean plenty of gold. I got a super rare from that. So you, you should have just said a super rare with common stuff, which was not worth 3 million coins. What the hell? They're wrong. Love the festivities. Love the idea of a new pack. I really, really do. But what the hell? <laughs> God, I'll forgive you. You've been really good to me in the last couple of days, so I'll be really good to you. And I'll... Water under the bridge, Ludia. Water under a bridge. But guys, if you've enjoyed the video today, make sure to drop a like down below. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and join my crazy bit of Verticonians. I'm going to stop with the Irish accent. And if you didn't enjoy the video for whatever reason, feel free to just like. Maybe it was a lack of gold. Maybe it was my Irish accents. Or maybe it was other things. Feel free to just like. But do tell me why, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Have a nice day. And hurrah!